What do you think the perception of Virginia food is from like a national perspective? I'll probably be making brothers see till the day I die. I would put yacht and blue crab neck and neck. I mean, that was something that was always in our house. There's a reason we're enjoying the food that we have today. With African American enslaved men and women that came over here, they're the ones that literally created from that African lineage the types of spices that we use in, in barbecue now. You really can't talk about Virginia food unless you talk about Brunswick stew. Having conversations like this, you have to do that because the dialogue is what's going to keep it present and bring it back. In order for this all to be relevant, we have to be honest about it. It's such a huge, rich history that is waiting to be told better.